Mass making for the masses has been a common practice all across our area, but these don't fit everyone. So we are looking for a product that can help our students as we go through this pandemic. It's very challenging times. Jeff Braven is the executive director at the American School for the Deaf in West Hartford. And for the deaf population, they're looking for some clarity. For them, it's crucial. We spoke with him with his interpreter, Heidi. Deaf individuals, we rely heavily on facial expressions for communication. So with a mask, that blocks that facial expression. So you see just the eyes, but not the full face. It's not yet approved by the FDA, but the American School for the Deaf has been working with a Maryland-based company called Clear Mask. We also have many students that rely on lip reading for communication purposes. Okay. You put that mask on and how can this kind of communication happen? It's a barrier. How could you understand me? So having the clear masks would really help with lip reading and comprehension. And Jeff tells us the more see-through masks, the merrier, because there are about 30,000 deaf and hard of hearing citizens across Connecticut. A North Carolina company called Safe and Clear has another version of the masks to aid the deaf. And as they approach the fall semester here, Jeff says creativity like this will speak volumes. I always say if there is a will, there is a way. And so we always find a way. We want to make their lives as normal as much as possible. So I will do everything I can to think outside of the box and make it happen. In West Hartford, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News.